sap tubers uh doing quite a bit of stuff on my truck but just gonna explain a little bit about those uh, three inch intake plenums right now um let me get up in there a little so i just swapped them went from the two to three i must say it's a major difference i mean the twos just look like babies compared to threes so uh I also did not know you needed a different pedestal for the upgraded turbo. The front of the compressor housing hits on the pedestal. So you, if you're gonna do this three, eight, three inch intake upgrade and turbo, you're gonna need the pedestal also. So um, let me explain, let's see, this side is cut and dry. Okay, well, I mean, I did, I did take off the wiring harness though. See, so it's not just easy. I got this stuff peeled all back and peeled forward. I just, I'm doing the exhaust right now in the up pipes. Um, it's gonna get cold tomorrow. So I decided to uh, get this sealant on here. The high temp RTV, I think it's like 600 degrees or something. But uh, okay, here's the deal. Um, you gotta get everything off here. I had to take these guys loose too. Um, and move them out of the way but you don't have to take that one that one bolt that's back there that's like hard to get out and you can't even you can't even uh get out because it hits a component you don't have to take it out just back it out as far as you can and then you'll pop that the old one off you know you'll just use a chisel or whatever and then pop it off and pull it back and then when you're cleaning it out it's not really that hard you know uh i just use some like carb cleaner in my finger really but um you could use like some scotch bright or something and then make sure that everything that gets in the intake you take out um clean out the valley i i cleaned it out before i did the work so what i i mean this is i say that's clean but that's still like carb cleaner there was like a, a nest in here uh from the previous guy so most people don't clean out their trucks enough and they don't know that there's nests in these commonly. So um, this side's cut and dry. That side is, you gotta take a few parts off. You gotta take your uh, bracket for your glow plugs. Um, and then uh, then it's pretty easy. You gotta, you gotta just slide it under there real easy without smearing it all as you get it back in there. But uh, that's pretty simple. So. Uh, let me think if there's anything else. I guess I already explained. You need the turbo, the pedestal, and those plenums, and the spider, obviously. You need the spider, um, the newer one with the three inch. So uh, I guess that's it.